I managed to piss off the entire internet. Or, well, one subsection of people on Twitter, which is basically the entire internet. With a J Schlatt twink meme. I know how that sounds. It sounds like I made it up, but it's not. <laughs> I am in a little bit of goblin mode, all right? You gotta do. What the f are you? Good evening. What's on your face? God, clean yourself up, you look like shit. So, uh, hold on, wait, uh, maybe I can, one minute. Ah! F <laughs> I just wanted to look cute. Hold on. Okay, don't make fun of me. I'm gonna say something that's easy to make fun of, okay? So I cried recently. <laughs> I cried over Twitter drama, okay. Okay. A little bit, maybe a little bit. I got- I- people called me- people called me names, and I- <laughs> People called me names, and I cried. Huh. Ah! Alright! No, what was I saying about being manly? I'd say I've been alive for a couple decades. I I'm sure that I've cried more than- more than then. More than that one time. So it's gotta have been more than once. Maybe even more than two at a stretch. There was that one time on stream, and that's sort of it. But uh, can you guys uh, f off with your making me cry thing? Because it's happened like twice in the last w what a week. Women, are you? Are there women here that like cis guys? Like just just straight you cis hear dudes? You suck. Straight cis women, they're into straight cis men. Are there any of you? Hi, chassis. You? Eh, I don't know if you count. No. Okay. Well. <laughs> now we can stop holding it in. Ugh. Ugh. Ah. Ah. Are you f***ing with us? Or is, like, or is Andrew Tate right? The tears like, don't okay. fall. They crash around me. Sh- <clears throat> That's good. Surely. Surely it's not an attractive thing to cry. Surely not. What do you mean? Why can't I? Why? Okay, I don't know why. What? What? You're so surprised. Look, I am basically Andrew Tate too. Like you're. Oh, you're surprised, bro. I can't. I was. I can I was here before Sneeko, dude. I, that's what my content will become. You realize that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Finn's the CEO of a charity for trans care. Okay, sure. Whatever. We'll talk about that later. He also hates women. <laughs> that's what I want. That's what I want to be known as. But no. Okay, give me a real answer. Is that? Is that a thing? Being vulnerable. Because I, I, I don't know. Yeah, okay, so, right. Do you want the drama update? Twitch people that may not know me on other platforms, do you want to know? If you guys aren't aware, I tweeted this out, I think. I stand by this tweet, it's funny. Uh, <laughs> I <t> tweeted <laughs> It's a picture of Jay Schlatt. Throw back to three years ago, wow, I've really changed. And, uh, people did not like that. People did not like that one. Uh, that, that was a misstep, uh, apparently. So, mm. a couple very prominent trans influencers on Twitter really, uh, they tweeted out that they didn't like it. They didn't like the fact that I was just this guy and I was making a transition timeline, which I was not. But it's very hard to understand that I'm not if you don't know who I am. It was a parody, but it was fun. It wasn't parodying trans timelines, but it was par it was parodying of a before and after. <laughs> he injects his wang with silicone. Jay Schlatt or me? Because I do. I didn't know Schlatt does. I'd say about 90% of people were like, you know, defending me and shit. But it started to dig into like my past. I've never been canceled on Twitter before. No, no one's ever tried to cancel me before. So what ended up happening was like people dug into like the old Omegle videos, like the four year old Omegle video, the very first one I ever made. Oof. I've taken it out of the video now because that, you know, <laughs> not my best move. But like, there's like, do you remember that meme like a while ago? The trans woman that got like very mad in a GameStop? The one that yelled at his ma'am, you know? So I made a joke about that. Not my, a bit of a misstep, but you know, four years ago, very different time. Uh, me at 18 years old, very different to me at 22 years old. Uh, so, a <clears throat> bunch of people dug into my past and fair enough. And that's spurred a bit of a, not great, a uh, little, little thing on Twitter. And I cried about it, okay? I had one night of weakness. I was up for way too long recording a Minecraft video. I'd like woken up at like 11 p.m. and then stayed awake through the a.m.s, through the p.m.s, and then made a post at 2 a.m. the next day or something like that. I was... I was... I was tired. 
I promise. I am more emotionally resilient. Okay, if I explain myself, people got... <laughs> It wasn't like like genuine um, like people were criticizing the things like fair enough like someone someone like sure the bad jokes I'm like but it was more that like people were calling me like, <laughs> the death threats whatever that was fine I didn't really give a fuck about death threats. to give you a bit of context last stream I thought it would be funny to make fun of how me and Jay Schlatt sort of look alike from him when he was in his uh, twink years <laughs> and not how Jay Schlatt looks like Jay Schlatt now and after a few hours that tweet going out. It blew up, but not for good reasons. People saw my tweet about Jay Schlatt and thought it was mocking a trans timeline. If you've ever seen them before, it's when someone posts a photo of themselves pre-transition and then a photo of themselves after. And when you think of that, it does happen to look exactly like that. To be clear, the only thing I was mocking was Jay Schlatt. <laughs> oh, come on, we did look a little bit alike. And I'd also never make fun of trans people. My God. I'm gonna talk about it later, but all the while in the background of this, I've been setting up a charity for a big thing. And after a few prominent people quote retweeted it, it spurred a lot of attention. And it may be cringe, but I've never had people say the things they said about me before this point. And I got a little bit in my feels. Don't get me wrong, there was so many people that were coming to my defense and showing people that it was a joke and that cross-dressing as a thing is fine. You can be gender non-conforming and be... <laughs> and I've never had people saying the things that people were saying about me. I was getting, like, death threats. And to be honest with you, whatever. Death threats really don't bother me. The thing that bothered me was a community that I felt pretty close to, which is the LGBT trans community, a community that I really wanted to give back to, were calling me slurs or disgusting or that I shouldn't exist or I should... You know, <laughs> not the most fun to deal with, to be honest with you, from people that I liked and that I respected. Maybe it's cringe, but I kind of was in my feels about it a little bit. I think people care, like, the idea- Like, it's really easy to be like, oh, I was getting death threats. They don't fucking matter. Like, it <laughs> doesn't matter about it. I think the thing that hurt was, like, a bunch of trans folks were, like, calling me, like, gross and shitty and that I hated them and that, that I was transphobic and shit. And that, like, got to me. But it leads into the next topic. All while this was happening for the last few months. <laughs> Again, I don't know if you've checked my posts or whatever, but I've been working on a thing. So this is, this is I shut the fuck up about it. I didn't use it as any defense. I've been working on something for a real long time now. And uh, I announced it, which was pretty cool. I'm not going to play you the whole video because it's two and a half minutes long and that's boring and dumb. But I am giving away 50 grand, uh, $50,000. 25,000 that's coming from me, 25,000 that is coming from 10 Muses as his final hurrah. I told him about my plan to give away the money and exactly what I wanted to do with it, and 10 was fucking into it, and he's fucking matching it, which I think is really fucking cool. I think it's absurdly good. So I'm trying to help that one specific problem. To explain a little more than in that video, the plan is to set up like an actual honest to God charity. Like, this is not me, money, Trevor Project, something like that. But obviously, amazing, fun to donate, amazing charity to donate to Stonewall Project, Trevor Project, they're great. But like, this is one of those things where I want to see exactly where my money goes, and it's all, if I'm hosting it, it's always going to go directly to help someone, rather than pay a bunch of executives as well, even though a lot of these charities are very good. I know that if it's my money and it's me doing it for free, not taking any salary, I can give it 100% to a somewhere. Right? I know it's being used well. Nice. So, that's what I'm doing. And it's specifically to help one problem, and I don't really see many charities doing that. So, I'm literally making this charity. Like, I'm gonna run it. Me and Ten will run it, actually. It's really helpful. Ten being a doctor has ran a clinic before, that it's good to know how that system works with how to link clinics with charities, stuff like that. Something I don't know too much about is like therapists and shit. I have no contact with anyone in that, but that's something that I want to do in the future too. I aim for this to be a start of something. This is not me donating 50 grand and going, all right, cool. This is going to be one of those things that I want to be like a life thing. Like, a, like this is what I want to do to help. I talk a lot about like, I feel like I don't give enough back. This is me running a company specifically, like a whole organization specifically to do this. And TTS is off, yes, but I wanted to talk for a while. But yeah, you know what's fun that you could have a direct impact in? I gotta name it. I gotta come up with a name of the charity. I haven't named it. I feel like the naming it, making a fucking website is less important. So I just didn't. <laughs> Chassis was... <laughs> 
<laughs> Jesse was in DMs with me saying like, I was like, oh, I haven't named it yet. I haven't met. She was like, I thought you'd have figured this out before. And I went, <laughs> no. <laughs> it's gotta be an egg joke. Oh. <laughs> That'd be so fucked. That'd be so fucked. No, I'm not calling it the egg fun. People are gonna, people are gonna get so mad at me if I call it the egg fun. You know what's weird? I really did think about calling it the Rose, like Rose Fund. It's not a bad name, especially because I don't really go by Rose. Like, Rose is kind of a pretty thing. Warrior Princess. Fuck yeah, that's me. I want a sword. I want a sword so fucking badly. I've been thinking about buying a sword for the last like few weeks now. Like, I want an actual like knight's sword, like a long sword, like a great sword. Like, not a cheap one, not, okay, not like a good one-handed sword, so like a great you sword, you know? Now. Something I have to lift with both hands, that's what I want. Also, f yeah, send me a throne. A <laughs> throne? Like, to replace the chair? It needs to be a, like, pink throne. <laughs> I don't know if anyone can custom make me a throne, but I'll take it. One don't write us of as just stands. We know you aren't perfect, but when we know you are in the right and we worry about you, please respect that. I don't think also, you're chat, it's now our job to keep Rose around till daddy comes back. Hashtag Tens Roses. <gasps> I don't like the name Tens Roses as a thing. I don't like it. It's, it's me. Oh my fucking god, they really def- Oh! Jesus Christ! Eight week delivery time. That seemed- okay. That's- this is- okay, Jesus Christ. I need that for my just like my streaming chair, like to replace this, because it's this thing's dying. Um, hey Shadow Realm man here, I have a hey. suggestion <laughs> for a name, like I said in council chat, Bussy Incorporated. Come on, I... <laughs> don't say no. <laughs> swear to God, I swear to God, I saw that earlier and didn't even respond. I, I did. Thank you for giving me money just to tell me that again. That such a. <laughs> That secret folder must be overwhelming if he's excited to show it. Dude, I mean, look. Would you even be fucking interested, though? Interested? Interested? Doesn't even fucking describe it! <laughs> yeah, um, the videos take a while to be edited. Past me didn't really have a plan of how soon it'd be. <laughs> oh, we know how that ended up. Links in the description. All right, mark it in the calendars, boys. If I quit Minecraft, is there a shaking hands emoji? Like... All right, let it be known. Clip channels, this is the moment. If I quit Minecraft, I will start an OnlyFans. Deal? Deal. And you will all buy it. All of you. Cool? Nice. <laughs> Damn it, wait, sh I should do- No, f wait, bad marketing. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. I should do like- No, no, f no, 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 no. It should- f No, I goofed it. Hold on. It should be like, uh, if I hit a million followers or some sh No, oh, what? Uh, uh, <laughs> This should be, like this could have been way better. Damn it! How many followers am I at? Like 500k? What am I at? Shh, almost 600. Okay, follow me. <laughs> no going back, bro. <laughs> That's one of those ones that I'm I'm wearing it. Uh, the folder. The, the, the anyway. Um. Anyway. Um. Um. Uh. What next? Uh. So yeah. No. But this look like uh, sure. Great photo. Really. It's like I mean you know. Great photo, but like, uh, not a great, meh. For your Instagram story, you said you were andro androgynous. I'm just not like, okay, so that's the point that I fit into. Like, I don't pass as a girl, but I definitely don't look like, I don't want to say it. <laughs> I don't want to say it. Like, I look, right. But like, okay, I don't look particularly, right. I look masculine enough to not look like a girl, but I don't look It's androgynous. I look androgynous. Hey, math. How is it you were more comfortable going out in girl than you didn't pass at all? But now that you can pass if you choose, you're completely opposed to it. It's Afraid the com- of cracking All right. Egg. That's a good topic, and you're completely wrong. Uh, let me tell you why. It's way easier for me to go out in essentially straight up drag. Like, over the top sort of sh Like, I don't- I don't look like a woman. I know that I don't. You know that I don't. We're all good. But like you look like you look like you're trying now, right? A little bit. So like, here's the thing. The reason why it gets a little awkward is for me anyway. Is like, I notice the way people treat me differently. If I go in like a big dress and everything, people are like, oh, sh nice going, dude. That's funny. Cool. You look kind of good though, dude. That works. 
Like, that's the response I get. Hey, dude, fucking sick makeup, bro. That That's pretty dope. The thing that I get when I go out now is like... Hey... Hey... Sir, man, um... What? Right over here, person. Come to your table, person. I don't know how to talk to you. Like, that's what I get. And it's like... I don't like that. I don't- I really don't like that. I can't describe why. It's- there's some- that's valid. Right! <laughs> Finn experiences the queer experience. Is this a thing? We heard that you're gay. Oh god! I just want to give you some money, Tweet. Can I give you some money? A lot of people go through this, not just me. Oh, hey man. I don't, uh, you know, fucking. Honestly, if it weren't for the lashes, I'd like this one. Uh, masculine. I take- I, can I have this knife? On, Thank you. One. Everything. Also, like, people mostly see this. I get into an Uber, they see this. Like, I- this doesn't look like girl, this looks like guy. You just- you just know what I look like underneath this fucking little thing. I'm just fucking, you know, don't look- <laughs> Girl mode. I'm on my phone, I'm fucking, you know. GUY! <laughs> you used to need a wig to pass as a girl. Now you need a fake beard to pass as a guy. Do you see what I mean? Alright, so you are in this scenario. Five, Only five, you seven, here. and you also five, have six? feminine mannerisms. I vibe, dude. You know? You look like a non binary bottom. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> That's how fast it'd be. You wouldn't even see it coming. You wouldn't even see it coming. Little, f oh, little five, six. You wouldn't even know. Wouldn't even know. <sighs> Top vibe. Don't look at my titties. Now I've got like the North Face jacket on. This is my impression of like an average guy in the UK. Like, hey man. Oh, sorry. Do you want the time? Yeah, sorry. Here it is. Fuck. <laughs> Fucking yeah. Try me again. Give me your money. Oh, ow. Oh. This is like you make eye contact. Don't go. What's up, man? Hey. Yeah, loose legs. Okay, well, I'm not wearing these. I don't wear these in public. Okay, so apparently the trick to looking masculine is just look like. Shit. Um. <laughs> hey, bro. Uh, wanna play? Uh, soccer? Don't mess with Finn. He keeps a knife in his prison purse. At all times! Hello, hello, hello! What's all this then? It's a little bird with a knife, isn't it? Pe Ooh! I well, couldn't, Minecraft I couldn't get rid is of it. dying. Yeah. <laughs> if it was a serious thing, if I did decide to one day quit it, seriously, I've asked before memingly, would you buy it? But like, I sort of want to know, like it was a real thing, would you? Would you want to see the folder? Real? Real purse? Real thing? Okay. Okay, good to know. Alright, okay, chat, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it, good to know. I get it, I get it, I get it! I get it! <laughs> I understand, you're horny, I understand! Alright. Who wins out of all of the femboys you can currently think of? Like, all of them. Include me, right? Anyone that identifies as a femboy, who wins? Obviously Nat. No one would win. Like, we've got to mentally check out Nat because it just doesn't count. Like, Nat would obviously smoke every single one of us. But he just- I'm just like, I have to not count him because he's never said the words that he's a femboy. Because I, I know- I've talked to him so many times and he- <laughs> Nat's like a man's man. It's so fucking funny. Like, when you speak to Nat about like what he does, he's like, yeah, it's fucking stupid. <laughs> Or at least when he was dressing up as a girl on a megal, he was like, Yep, just wanna be a fucking just wanna go pro on esports, man, but I guess I'll put on the wig. <laughs> you know, like he's doing other stuff now, which is nice. Better for him. But god, that's funny. So does the only person that's I think seen all of the photos. Oh my god! <laughs> Uh, you're gonna post that? Wait. I, I have taken a lot of photos that are less suggestive. I like hearing like reviews on it, you know, the whole follow down. Yeah, it's not a lot. It's not this crazy thing. Like I really, I'm hyping it up like there's tons in there, but there's just some good photos. There's just some good photos you guys like, like one of them would get you guys in a fucking. <laughs> 
one of them would get you fucking, fucking fire going in you. I get ten good ones, but like, it's just shit that you've never seen me do, you know? But it's good. Alright, so all I'm saying is I would die. I would die. I would lose this fight. Soda wins. While Soda is shorter than me, at like 5'7 or something, 5'8, five, 5'7, five, I think Soda's 5'7. I googled it once, yeah, and you'd like it. Shut the fuck up, Jesse. This <laughs> Like, dude, sheesh, right? Damn, he's looking good, right? Like, so, dude, so, bro, so, so to kick my fucking ass, so to kick my fucking ass. Thank <laughs> you for being you. Oh. Also, could you call me a good girl? In what voice do you think? Like, deep voice? You've been a, you've been a good Short girl. Short kings rise oh, up as God. high as you can. You've been a good girl. Ah, God, ah! Okay, cut it. Uh, I want to do a girl voice instead. That's, that's better. <sighs> Have you been a good girl? <laughs> I- I- ah! I hate this. I hate all of it. It's gotta be like- it's got- I hate it. Like, my- my character has to be into dudes. My character has to be into dudes. That's the thing. There's something about good girl and mommy that sounds so fucking creepy. Like, it's- I can't do it. I can't flirt- I can't flirt with women. It's just not- it's just not in my- it's just not in my thing. Whenever I've had a girlfriend, we just don't do that. <laughs> I just like ah oh god I hate it I hate it I hate it it's the conditioning No it isn't <laughs> Now that's a red face That's a strange effect that this that this has had Uh it's not like it's not like my preferences have changed but it sounds weirder to be All right it be, don't get me wrong like if you guys called me god it'd be really creepy like I'd be leading a cult but like I- bro, why do you- why do you guys not call me goddess, dude? On stream, you're submissive to the entire community. How can you argue with 11 months of forced girl month? <laughs> not- not submissive. Christ. Okay, fellas, I'll see you 